Good morning everybody and welcome to our first full day in Cebu. Before starting this video, a little disclaimer. In the Philippines you are not allowed to hunt nor kill crocodiles. In the most of the world you can, but here not. So if you encounter them, please run, because if they are so mean to their own species, imagine what they can do to you. But for real guys, last year a person died every other day because of crocodile's attack. Be safe. Today we're going to the Taoist temple. A caldo. <laughs> for tourists. So guys, we are not allowed to do anything in this temple. No pictures, no photos, no videos. There are just these little dragons. It's raining and there are like 30 degrees. It's incredible. Guys, uh, to me this temple looks like a playground for kids. What do you think, Walter? I think I don't want to make it too exclusive, but I mean, come on, we can take picture around. This place is a bit of a disappointment, maybe even more than a bit. Therefore, now we are going to check out uh, a way to go to Oslo, where we will finally see the great whale sharks. Oh my gosh, I cannot wait. Oops, I just realized that uh, I've been editing the wrong day. I ate the crocodile on the previous one. Hey guys, today we are at Puerto Princesa airport and we have to kill way too much time so we decided to try the crocodile meat. Well, Walter didn't decide that. He opted for uh, beef. I don't want to risk guys, that's yeah. why. They want to be safe in life. And I want to risk it all. They told us uh, it tastes like uh, chicken. Someone told that it tastes like pork but should be good. So Walter is saying his meat is pretty good. Do you confirm it? Yeah. I can say. So it's time to try the crocodile. <laughs> I actually really like it. Uh, are you sure you don't want to try it? Oh gosh. Approved. Troppo buono, lo assicuro. Is he gonna be safe? Come on. What's your opinion? I don't know. You know when you try something for the first time and you're not convinced 100%. Eatable. After doing some research on the web, I found out that in the Philippines they have crocodile farms, their meat is sold all over the world, and the leather is sold to big fashion brand like Louis Vuitton. I think it's important that when you travel, you are open-minded to different traditions and especially the local food. In Europe we have no problem eating horses, so please don't give me a hard time for eating a crocodile. By the way, they say it has aphrodisiac properties. So maybe you wanna give it a try. That's it for today. Thank you for watching. Keep reading and believe in your dreams. Ciao. Don't forget to subscribe to not miss the next vlog. I'll be going to the Kawasan Falls and then to see the whale sharks.